Hi everyone, today I am going to discuss about first PUC annual theory exam blueprint of subject physics. Before that, those who are watching my videos first time, do subscribe and like the videos and do share the videos with your friends. Dear students, as you all know about the theory exam is going to be conducted for 70 mark and practical is for 30 mark here this blueprint explains about how the 70 mark is distributed in several sections and several chapters okay here there are four sections are mainly that is part a or section a next part b next part c and part d Okay. Here, part A includes MCQ as well as fill in the blank type questions, and part B includes only two mark type questions, and part C includes three mark type questions, and part D includes five mark type questions, both derivations as well as numerical problems. Okay. Here these are the chapters first chapter units and measurement the number of teaching hours is 3 and allotted mark is 3 this 3 mark is distributed for several section one is for mcq and another one is for essay type question 2 mark total 3 mark okay next motion in a straight line second chapter total 7 mark sorry 7 hours 6 mark this 6 marks is distributed in two sections those are for LA long answer and MCQ 1 total 6 and motion in a plane total 13 hours 12 mark this 12 mark is distributed in MCQ and FIB and SA type 3 mark and NP numerical problem short numerical one and one long answer total 12 mark next chapter is motion laws of motion laws of motion total 13 mark sorry 13 hour 12 mark here this 12 mark is distributed in several section mcq two questions and essay type short answer two mark type one question and uh, short answer three mark one question okay and numerical problem one question okay five mark total 12 mark and next one is work energy power 12 teaching hours 11 mark 1 mcq 1 essay type 3 mark question 1 essay type 2 mark question and 1 long answer 5 mark question okay total 11 mark next system of particle and rigid body 11 hours and 11 mark okay here Two mark type question one and long answer five mark question which is of splitted type st means split type you may get question like three plus two or two plus three okay the question has two sections a and b okay next uh, you may get numerical problem which carries three mark short problem and mcq one question okay next one is gravitation chapter 10 hours 9 mark okay this 9 mark is divided into several section one mcq one fill in the blank okay next uh, two mark question one and numerical problem one which carries five mark next one is mechanical properties of solids 
here four teaching hours four marks this four mark is divided into two sections that is one mcq and one short answer which carries three mark total four mark okay. next mechanical properties of fluids five hours and five mark one mcq one fill in the blank and one three mark type question total five mark next thermal properties of matter 11 hours 11 mark one mcq one two mark question one three mark question and one numerical problem which carries five mark next thermodynamics eight hours teaching and eight marks allotted and here one two mark type question one five mark question split type okay, derivations and one mcq question next one is kinetic theory five hours and five mark one mcq one fib and one three mark type question total five next one is oscillations for oscillation total eight hours and eight mark one mcq one one mcq and one two mark type question and one numerical problem which carries five mark total eight mark and last one is waves 10 hours 10 mark and one uh, mcq one fill in the blank one three mark question and one uh, derivation long answer five mark total ten mark if you prepare in this sequence you will get easily 70 mark in your annual theory exam and one more thing is in this academic year total number of questions became 45 in previous year it was 48 in the present year academic year 2014 sorry 2024 and 25 it is total 45 questions why because in all sections one option has been reduced in the part b earlier it was 9 now it was 8 and part c also 8 and in part d six questions are there earlier now it became five okay thank you